All right, we're back. Um, as if it's becoming a sort of a tradition with me, I ended the last episode by saying something we didn't need to immediately do because I forgot to do something else. So I'm going to go back to do the thing I forgot to do again. Also, there's these guys here. I forgot they were here. Hmm? Moo? They're cows, apparently. What have we here? You look awfully raggedy. Times are grim. The least you can do is look sharp. Don't you dare meet my lady like that. You might scare her off for good. I'll talk to whoever the hell I want. You are undead as well. We've no time to fraternize. I have my mission and you no doubt have yours. We must not let this curse overcome us. She's a nice lady. I like her. All right. Anyway. So, I guess that's the guys Mr. Dude wanted to meet up with, so good for him for meeting up with his dudes. But anyway, we need to make a jaunt, an expedition, as it were, back into the woods. And, uh, it's a little bit of a walk, so I'll go ahead and probably skip forward a little bit. Alright, now that we've rested that bonfire, I think it's down here. I might be wrong. But I don't think I'm wrong. Stop. Ow. God damn it. Did I kill all of them? Okay, good. Phew. 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 All right. Try going this way, and I'm not sure if I've been over this way yet. I heard that guy pop up. Ow! Forgot you were bad. Stupid snake vines. All right. Hmm. That's gonna be a creepy tree. Snake vines! Never mind. Completely forgot about that enemy, honestly. I don't even remember it. Oh shit. Poke. Alright then, so this boss, um, this is one of those bosses that I'm really not sure about. I'm actually going to have to use my shield for at least the first part of the fight. I have no idea how this is going to go, but basically this boss is going to be ranged for a good portion of the fight. And it looks very pretty. It's a, one of the prettiest bosses in the game, but uh, it, it really doesn't like us. Fireball! Um, I think I missed. Ah! Yeah, it's best if we can just block the hell out of it. <laughs> Should have probably equipped a magic resist shield instead of this stupid thing, but it's a little late to do anything about it now. Drink! Ow. We have a ton of Estus, that's good. Good, good that I at least had the four sat for that. Oh my god! Woo! Oh shit! Ah, you stupid butterfly! Ah. Okay, I remember how to dodge those. Good. Ah. And who? Oh. I know it doesn't look like we're doing good damage to it right now. Just just give it a second. Okay. Drink. Here we go. Okay. Two hands. Beat. And beat. And uh, beat. And oh, come on. One more attack. Yes. Oh, good. Good, 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 good. 
when it sits on the ledge, I think, if I remember right, it actually will explode if you do not kill it fast enough. And when it explodes, it would have been insta-death. So it's a little bit of a DPS check, I guess, if you can call it that. Um, but fairly easy boss you could probably take on before the twin gargoyles. I just happened to forget about it. Let's go up this here ladder. Oh, what do we have here? Watchtower basement key. Watchtower basement key. Watch... I don't even remember where that goes to. Oh, no. I think that is the back way into Havel. I think that's what that is. All right. Normally that... Yeah, that's the key I think that normally gets you access to Havel. If I remember right. Yeah, I think that's what that is. All right. So, we got something called the Divine Ember from doing that. And the Divine Ember is a very, very cool item. And I believe I will go see if I can tinker with that here in a second. You dick. I hate trees. Ugh. I forgot to explore the area over here, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do that really quick. Um, might as well dick with these trees while I'm over. This is reminding me that my health is really low, and that's not good. So maybe I should put some points in vitality too after this. Maybe. Sunny Deep! Ooh! The Eastern Set! I forgot that was over here. Um... What can I do with the Eastern Set? Easter set is slightly heavier, I think, but provides better protection against physical. Hmm. Alternatively, um, the plants in this forest do drop the blooming purple moss clumps I was talking about needing earlier. So you could just sit in here and farm for a bit before you go to the place we're going to go instead of worrying about that other thing buying them from the lady. But we'll see where we're at. I'll have to do a head count. What the hell? I thought I killed you already! Is there another one I didn't even know about? <laughs> that was out of nowhere. What the hell? Funny. It's funny that I was surprised, but it, that's kind of hilarious. Okay. Well, we got another Phantom Knight to kill, apparently. Ow. You dick. All my souls back. Give me them souls back. Now you're gonna rough and heal. No, 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 no. Need ghosts. True. Yes, I agree. Be wary of caster. Let's. Do I have my? Uh, hang on. Did I completely forget to get a? Um... I did. I totally forget to buy. Forgot to buy a orange soapstone, so I can't even leave messages. Uh... 
I'm damn. I might have to do that on the way back. I'll go buy one of those. I think the Undead Merchant has them. I'm used to just being able to get them. Like, Dark Souls 2 ruined me. It gave me all these bad... Oh, what am I doing? It gave me all these bad habits. Sir, I believe your AI is broken. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the third time I've experienced him just walking up to me and looking at me like uh, I'm gonna get you okay so let me justify what I'm doing here a little bit better normally you really wouldn't need to get this high in soul level I'm just doing this so I can get my weapon working for me um but there's actually two reasons I'm doing this. When we get down into the next place we're going, we're not actually going to have another chance to do this like really good, really easy soul grinding for a while. So I figured I'd just go ahead and get the most out of it I can while I can. Um, and in fact, before we leave this place, we are going to be doing a thing. Man, apparently you got part of that heal. And in fact, we don't need to go too far over to that particular section of the bridge. I've been avoiding it for a reason. Because there's a NPC over there that is part of the Forest Hunter Covenant that we do not want to fuck with right now. And I really don't want to pull him on accident. He is actually Shiva of the East, and we are using his armor set right now, or part of our, his armor set right now. Um, and once we join the Forest Hunter Covenant, he will become friendly to us, and I'll go talk to him. But for now... I want to go ahead and finish beating up all these guys, and then I'm going to go talk to Aviana about joining up with her team. Thirty-two. Alright, that should be it. Okay, let's see the super horrible move set. It's not... Ooh. Actually, it is. Dude, this is a janky-ass moveset. Look at this. That's so weird. <laughs> it's a really janky moveset. Ah, uh, I don't know if I like it. I don't... Um, what's a power attack? That's pretty cool. The power attack could be awesome. Is that like two attacks? One, two. Yeah, that that looks like two attacks. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Well, let's play with it a little bit here. Let's uh use it use it let's target practice on this guy. Whack, whack. No, it's only one it's only one move. It just looks like two. What a weird thing. Okay, so that's not even worth using. If it's only one attack. It looks like it would be two, because you go whack whack. It looks like that would be two attacks, but it's not. How odd. Cool. Okay, so most of the time I'm going to try to be using this thing in two hands, but if it comes down to it where I need my shield up, I'll at least not be screwed if I try to attack with my thing only in one hand. Alright, alright, got it. Cool. Okay, mm, what am I doing? No, don't go over there. Alright, let's talk to this lady. Yep, let's join. Join Covenant. Covenant established. Right here, take us this room. 
If thou wearest that ring, it allows for thine summoning. If mine senses reveal intruders, then I will summon thee. Fend them off, sir. I beseech only this. I shall summon others who will, by their honor, work tirelessly with thee. Thou shalt receive great reward, and whatsoever ye shall pillage will be thine own. A true agreement, not so. But thou must heed the golden rule. The clan is thine own family. To thine kinsmen forever stay true. Darest not in any attempt to double cross. Have no doubt, such wretchedness never. Okay, so the way this works is if you are in human form and you're in the forest killing all these NPCs, you will be attacked by... Oh, that guy doesn't even spawn if you're not. All right, cool. You will be attacked by blue invaders that are part of this covenant. Alternatively, if there's a guy attacking people in this forest and you have on the ring and... I think you're in human form, I don't remember exactly. You'll be summoned in to defend the forest. Um, so it's kind of like the bell tower in Dark Souls 2 in a weird way, but not exactly. It's a little wonky. I use it to troll people. Um, when I get bored later in the game, I might come back here for a bit of a victory lap and go human and just start murdering these NPCs and seeing who pops in to attack me. Because this is the PvP place. Like, this forest is PvP central, basically. Everyone PvPs here. So anyway, this is Shiva. I've heard all about you. I'm Shiva of the East, captain of the brigade. Let's teach you the clan basics now, as there's no time to chat in the midst of fighting. Except there is little in the form of rules. You hear. Fight and hunt as you like. Whoever's fastest gets the prey. That's the way we do it. Only don't forget what Arvina said. Traitors aren't given a second chance for any reason. That's about it then. Don't worry. It's a good old time, isn't it? Great to have you with us. Good hunting to you. Neither of us want to see you go. All right. Thanks, dude. Okay. Um, I need to think on something for a bit based on where we're going next exactly. Because now that I've given him the Divine Ember, mm, I need to think about something. And uh, I'll come back when I have successfully done research on it. But until then, thanks for watching Dark Souls. Uh, this was probably a little bit of a boring session, but hey. Sometimes you just gotta do it to make progress and be good. So, hooray. I can use this, and I can use this, without having to do this. Ho 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 